All right, let's find this treasure. Just land here. And we need to head south, I believe. Let's see. I'm just to the west of of New London, which is there. So I guess I need to head south, south east, which is like that. I think. There we go. Now I wonder what terrible dangers may lie afoot in the. Uh, jungles of the Caribbean here. I find a three-headed monkey. <laughs> Let's see. Where was? Wait, map. Map. I said map. No. Uh, oh. Oh, my shit. Oh, okay. It's not going to... Oh, I see. Well, I guess I've got to look out for these landmarks, like a deserted cabin, Inca temples, Ark, Brack, Giza. Oh, looks like I walked all the way around and didn't find anything. Where's all these landmarks? Oh, here's something. It's a deserted shack. Good. Uh, so... It, where is it in relation to the deserted shack? It is... Deserted cabin. Oh, there's, there's two of them. I guess that must be that one, because it's... So let's just head let's head straight east. Or... Yes. It, oh no, wait, there's the geezer. Right? So... It must be just... It must be that. It must be this, here. Oh, careful. Don't get sprayed on. Is that it? Yes! Awesome! Treasure! <laughs> Look, there's Murray up there on the uh, hanging on one of those spikes. A few hours of digging out comes Captain Kid's buried treasure worth 8,000 gold pieces! Yeah! Look at him. You can see, you can see, you can barely see. I am hanging as a testament to the forces of evil. Oh, the Inca Temple. Can I actually explore this stuff or is it just landmarks? Let's just find out. Nope, okay. Return to ship. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Look at how much money I have. Woo! Now what to do next? Uh, French bark. Okay, so I think I should attack a town now. I haven't done that before, have I? Let's head to that, um, where is it? That uh, pirate place here. And no, actually, let's, let's, let's investigate the general area. Poor French stronghold, 600 farmers, garrison of 60 soldiers. Okay, well that seems like easy pickings. Um, <laughs> and it's nearby to this. Yeah, let's let's go to that pirate stronghold and uh, actually me um, and sort out a raid on that town. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Oh, just Spanish ships though. Should I take them on? What are they? Trade Galleon, yes. Come here. Spanish Trade Galleon, 16 guns. Oh, I've got 32 guns. Yeah, my brig of war. Yes. Oh, it's got an escort. Oh, oh, this is slow. This is really slow. Oh my god, I can't even turn. What the hell? Is my, my numpad isn't working. Oh, there we go. I had numlock wrong for some reason. Oh no, get away, get away, get away. I got more crew than uh, I got more crew than them, but still they wanna. Which one is which? Is that the fast galleon or the trade galleon? I can't tell. Yeah. Oh, that's the fast galleon because it's the one losing all its crew to my grape shots. Yeah. And as you can see, I picked an appropriate name for this ship. Oh ho ho! Quantum cannons. <laughs> Photon grape shot. Yeah! I just felt like doing that. And let's, uh, let's take this one intact. Lock the tractor beams on and prepare to transport the boarding parties. <laughs> this game would be brilliant if it was a space game. Look at all that gold! Ah, oh, yes, gold cook. Excellent. Food. Yeah, let's have them. Oh, look at that! 51 tons of goods! Oh, it's, it's, it is damaged, but okay, fine. Take it all. Yeah. Oh, it's a bit close. Alright. And where am I going? <laughs> uh, oh, I really missed it. 
it's, it's to the south. Why, why am I all the way up there? All right. Now let's just see. I'm pretty sure I know what it means, but let's just check it anyway. Cook and prepare tasty meals at sea. Well, yeah. Okay. What does it mean in real terms? Does it increase the length of food? Uh, the, the time that food lasts, or does it just make people happy? Hmm. Food makes me happy. Okay, here we go. Pirate Haven. Let's. Uh, first of all, let's let's uh, let's trade. I don't think they're gonna. Have, no, they got no money. All right, well let's let's buy some food and sell some. Uh, that's not worth it. Okay, because they can't afford much. So there are any pirates. All right. Uh, let's first take on some more men. Twenty-five more men. Uh, oh, I know this is a lightning quick thrust dueling skill. Oh, okay. Where is he? He's way over there. I'm not going to bother with that. Ship running ground behind. Can I upgrade your ship with fine grain powder? Okay. Um, right, let's talk to the captain of this pirate place. Florida Keys, there's very few soldiers. Let's do it. It's right there. Plunder wins. Now it seems that these pirate raiders that I sent to attack them, to attack the, the town, uh, do indeed, that is indeed what happened. Now let's see if I can, if I can raid these people. No, it doesn't seem I'm even able to. Huh. Um. Alright, well let's, uh. Hmm. I don't know. Everyone's poor here. I need I need somewhere to sell all these goods for one thing. Um, the Harbin is a wealthy Spanish capital. Well, I don't think I should take on the cow. Four hundred forty soldiers. Um, right. I want somewhere to plunder. Why can't I plunder that place? Um, oh well. Um, I don't think I'll be able to um, land at a Spanish town. So let's head uh, somewhere else. Oh, there's an Indian village there. I haven't seen what they have to offer before. Let's see. Can we do anything other than just mercilessly slaughter them? I think that's the history. Uh, trade with the chief. Uh, they have sugar. And it's cheap. Let's have that. Yeah. Um, let's see, they'll buy goods. Just give him one of them. Cool. Um, let's talk to him. Bloody hell, chill out, will you? The warriors grow tired of the province of the European colonists. A war canoe is prepared. Which city is weak and ripe for destruction? Uh, yeah, let's go to Florida Keys. Why not? We will crush the weaklings, Jim Smallbeard. Good. Good luck to you. <laughs> Off they go. Indian war canoe. <laughs> You're gonna die. Sorry, it's just the way history went. <laughs> Why am I laughing about it? It's horrible. It is. But, you know. Looks like my crew is becoming unhappy. Might be time to divide up the loot. Although, between 273, I hope that's, that's not gonna be too much uh, stuff. Oh well. I'm almost running out of food as well. Hopefully, I'll get more. I, I think I'll, I'll be able to. Oh, Santiago's poor. Damn it. Not gonna be able to buy much, are they? Um, all right. Well, let's get some food off them so I can have enough time to get to another settlement, and then uh, sell some of these spices. And there. Right. Uh, shipwrights. Oh, can upgrade triple hammocks for my defiant. There we go. And repair. And let's see. So Yeah, sorry Serenity. <laughs> I took the sky from you. <laughs> uh let's see. Seven yeah, let's get rid of Nina. And I can get rid of that one. And all I need all I have left is uh, my Defiant and my Trade Galleon, that's a good pairing. Okay. Uh, 
Let's talk to the governor, see if he'll promote me again. My dear blah blah blah, uh, evil thingy. Yes. Oh, no, 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 fuck off. Don't want to dance. Okay, no more promotions. But, um, it does look like I need to, uh, start dividing up the loot because my crew is unhappy. Now, which, is Port Royal a decent town? Uh, modest English port. Okay. Let's just head there then. It's somewhere anyway. I need to get there in two months, I hope I can. <laughs> Well, my crew might desert. That'd be terrible. I'd have less people to divide up the loot with. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Port Royal. Port Royal. Port Royal. Royal Port. This is not poor. Okay. Let's do some trading. Get rid of all this stuff. Can I sell all? Okay. Mm. I don't want to yeah, I might as well sell all. Oh, it doesn't include the food. Okay. All the guns. It just includes those. Well, that's handy. Let's sell some, some of these guns as well, because I don't fucking need all those. Let's just take it down to, like, 50. And some of this food, too. Um, yeah. Now, since I'm going to be dividing the plunder, I might as well get rid of... Or do I keep that? I don't know. I suppose it'll be part of the plunder anyway, so it doesn't really make any difference. Um, okay, uh, divide. With great anticipation, yeah, loot is divided among the crew. Each man gladly takes 94 gold as his share. You'll be able to keep your flagship defiant. As apprentice captain, your 5% share comes to 1361. Okay, let's have it. Your health is fine, and as the months pass, you quickly become bored with life on land. And so your flagship is refit and a bold crew assembled as you prepare to set sail for further adventures. Oh, advance to journeyman. Okay, I guess that means um, it's an increase in difficulty, which is something I was about to mention, is that this game is kind of too easy. But it looks like it's allowing me to increase the difficulty, which is good. So let's do that. Ding, 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 ding. But yeah, in any event, I was kind of thinking of making it a retirement thing because I'm going to... I think I'm going to leave the video here soon, but um, yeah, this is uh, this is a really cool game. But I think I've played it enough right now. Um, if you want to see more, let me know um, what you think. And also, like I said before, definitely worth checking out Pack Billy's video of the original pirates on the Mac, and I'll also link to my video about the Amiga version of this game. So, this was Sid Meier's Pirates, as you know, because you've been watching it for fucking ages. So. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.